Hello, welcome back to Let's Play the Final Fantasy IV. This is Drake Lord 56. The hero you're better off of the. Oh, yeah, how? Let's try that. Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IV Advance. This is Drake Lord 56. The hero you're better off without. And you, that hesitation meant yet yeah, again that I almost said tactics advance. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So yeah, I played that game far too much. So yeah, we last time we just went to be a giant octopus to death, and here we are at Domsian. Oh boy, that's bad. That's bad. Well, that's yeah, that's a bad. Yeah. Oh boy, uh, Yeah. Yeah. They, they stole the crystal. <laughs> wow. Wow, not only did the bomb the place, they also took everything that wasn't nailed down. The only pot's upstairs, I must... No. The morph it was too much. Is that... It is Anna. You all that part and I'll run away because of your treachery. You spoony bard! No, wait. Wow, tell her, are you okay, man? <laughs> Four times! I think it was a mistake putting him into the back row. There we are! <laughs> Die! P please, listen! Miss. We'll see how many times he misses before the next hit. Got him! <laughs> I know this is some. Oh. Shut up! Forgive me, please! I know this is a, <laughs> a dramatic of scene, but God, him missing every nearly every shot. <laughs> Take this, uh, Father! Stop! Oh, Anna, I'm so glad to see you again, Edward. Father, Edward is the Prince of Domsian. Forgive me, Father, for running away, but I love Edward. Still, I knew I couldn't find happiness without your consent. I was on my way home when... We were attacked by Baron's Red Wings, led by Golbez. I have never heard of Golbez before. Who is he? I don't know. All I know is that his powers were beyond words. But why did they attack Domsian? They wanted the crystal. They spared no one to get it. My mother, my father, even Anna shielded me from their arrows. You love him enough to give up your own life? Father, forgive me. I love you. Anna! 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 Damn you, Golbez! Who is that monster anyway? What do you know about him? He 
came to Baron one day and became the new leader of the Red Wings. If he leads them on their mission to blunt the crystals. Stop your simpering! That won't bring Anna back! Gold as a Baron. And I shall take his life with my own two hands! Tello, wait! You can't possibly go alone! I will kill Gobis on my own! I don't need your help! I don't need anyone's help! And just like that, he's gone. anymore. <coughs> right here. I don't care. Leave me alone. I'm staying here with Anna. I'll never leave her aside. That's enough! You're now the rifle rule of Domsian, so start acting like it! You owe it to your people, and you owe it to Anna. Your Majesty, my name is Cecil, and I need your help. What? My friend is suffering from desert fever in Kaipo. I need to get the sand ruby to get to save her. Can you help me? What is her name? Rosa. She is very dear to you, isn't she? Like Anna was to me. You can find the sand ruby in the antline cave, which lies to the east. The ruby forms from the fluid that secretes the antline when, it's, when it lays its eggs. We must uh, cross the shadows with our hovercraft to reach the cave. What the fuck? <laughs> hovercraft. Hovercraft. Yep. Yep. We, after we acquire the sand ruby, we can cross the shadows to reach Kaipo. God, I just a, a medieval uh, kind of a uh, society, and uh, they. Well, sure, they make flying vehicles powered by magic, but <laughs> fucking hovercrafts. Prince Edward has joined the party. <sighs> Goodbye, Anna. There's our hovercraft! So we can't exactly go over the sea itself with it, but... There are these shells here that we can actually go over. And you might have seen some like this near Baron. So let's see where this place is. Ah, I think I found it right there! Let's head on in. The Antline Cave. Yellow Jelly! I think I should just bring Edward to the back here. That's not helping. Let's just get out of here and try... Wow, Edward, dude, seriously, we've got to help. We got to get you some help. And 
know. Do I have? I don't have very much for uh, <laughs> for healing shit. So let's uh put him. No, put him in the back row here. Yeah, as you can see, he 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 is in dire straits in terms of. Okay, there we are. New enemy there. Adamantoys. If you remember from a uh, Final Fantasy 3, you know what these guys are weak to. Like, seriously weak to. Oh, yeah, that just annihilated him. Spider Silk? I'm guessing that's slow. Potion! Yay! Oh, oh, back attack! Shit, 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 crap! Run, 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 run! Don't wanna do this! Dude! No! Yeah, that was the other ambush scenario. I mean, sure, they, they streamlined the switching the rows, but... Yeah, that, we, that's still basically getting caught with our pants down. Now, Rydia cannot do much, but... Well, Edward, on the other hand, still can't do much. Let's try this. Oh, that's helpful. Especially since it didn't work. So yeah, whatever song he plays is dependent on what his uh, equipment is. Don't want to deal with the yellow jellies. Don't want to experiment right now. Fuck it, you want to experiment? Uh, fine, I'll experiment. Uh, let's try uh, Thunder. That works. We uh, well, let's just anyway. And now Edward's less of a pussy. Oh, I didn't see you up there. Gold Needle! Cool! In case anybody is turned to stone, we've got a way to reverse it. I'm glad I went this way first, because we got some more stuff here. Ah, cool! A tent! More potions! Sweet! We're not in such dire straits anymore. And, uh, Edward can actually act as a rudimentary backup healer. He actually can use a a, a single po a single potion to uh, uh, to heal a group for a little bit. Wow, that's a lot of big guys. Let's go for Leshy, whatever the hell that means. And uh, I don't know. Hi, basically he's he just go he runs off screen and. and uh, Decides to be a little bitch about it. There we are. You're down. Now let's take care of this basilisk. Yeah, it's not working, is it? There we are. That thing's down. God, I want to go out and get some stuff! Sweet! Antarctic wind! Basically a free... I think it's a Blizzara? And... 
what's in here. Lobby harp, cool. I don't know what it this teaches him, but it's a, undoubtedly a better weapon. If I remember correctly, there is this thing over here. And this is... Save point! Cool! And a lot of treasure chests. Phoenix down. Another ether suite. And an emergency exit. So we could just... A GTFO if things go wrong. I'm using a tent. And I think we've basically seen all of the enemies in this cave here. Supplies. That's good. Wow, more slow. Awesome. Ooh, new enemy there. Sandworm. I wonder, are you weak against Blizzard? Sense of logic, I think. Nope. Ah, I wanted to confuse you. Oh well. Now I think we've given. Uh, We've seen all the enemies around here. Nothing there looks like. I should mention that the uh, the 3D version of this game actually literally rewards exploration. And I think we found it. The Adline Nest. So let's just make sure that everybody's good to go here. So, yeah, I think we're, we're good to go here. So let's go get this ruby. This is where the antline lays its eggs. It's okay. Lines are quite tape. They don't attack people. Here, I'll demonstrate by taking the sand ruby like so. Ah! Come on, we have to help him. Boss fight against the end line. Holy shit, that's like nightmare fuel. All right. Well, this guy will uh, always counter attack whenever you you do an attack on him. Wow, that did not do very much at all. I wonder. 32. And that does... Miss. Good, good news, Edward. You're gonna be... Uh, our, uh, our healer here. Yes. Song of Enticement. Nothing happens. I thought Rydia was uh, doing something else there. Uh oh. Alright. Potion time for Rydia. Alright, let's bring out our Chocobo, I suppose. 
Stop hitting right, you asshole! Yeah, that's... that's pretty good. Nope, didn't confuse him. But it get us it did get us closer to... Oh, wow! Critical strike! And he attacked the correct person. Good. Wow, you're doing minuscule damage with your... With your regular attacks, dude. Wow! Two crits, dude! Nice job! This guy should be going down pretty soon. There we are! Got him! And, uh, Yep, there we are! Done! Got the Sand Ruby! How could this happen? They've always been totally harmless. Monsters are rapidly multiplying these days, and their behavior is changing as well. I can't help but feel that this is some kind of sign. Come on, let's go cure Rosa! Right, let's go! Before we do that, I want to bring Edward to the front row because, uh, Something that's coming up will be a lot easier. So, I think with that, it'll be a good time to end off this episode. So if you like this one, hit the like button, comment on it, and if you want, subscribe. So until next time, see you later. I should just sort this stuff here.